Hello and welcome to a tutorial on how to host a server for your LAN. So that means if you're playing on a local area network or you're connected to the same router. Um, well the first thing you want to do, I'm just going to get right into it here. I'm not going to bombard you with a one minute intro and ramble on for five minutes about the game. I'm just going to tell you how to do it. So you want to go to your desktop and you want to click on the start button if you're using Windows 10, obviously. Um, and you want to type CMD. What that's going to do is bring up the command prompt and you basically all you need to do is type in IP config. And all this does is it tells you your IP address and it's this one here that you want the IPv4 address and that is your unique, unique, not unique, Jesus, unique IP for your computer. So you can see here mine is 192.168.0.7 you want to either write that down or just remember it and you want to give that to the person who's going to try and connect your server and that's got to be on LAN that won't work over the internet I'll do that in a separate video but basically what you want to do is just remember this and go into the game so I've got the game open here go on multiplayer host server give it a name give it a password well you don't really need a password because it's LAN but oh well. Um, UPMP. So you want you want to have that checked. I've got I've got it checked even if I've got it put forwarded. But it's up to you. You can try it both ways. Sometimes it will work. Sometimes it won't. It says it's not reliable. So um, yeah, you want obviously spawn box. You say difficulty mode. Your map. And internet online. What you want to do here is basically just put in what I've got. That might be default for you, but this is what it's this is what it was default for me, and it works. So you want to try that. It says LAN there, look, local area network does not require anything special. Clients will have to connect to you using direct IP, putting in your private IP address. You find it in basic server settings. Just make sure your Windows firewall is not blocking this application. So if we start the server, base select, let's play as um, Piranha to join that server obviously you've got to have it running you want to go list servers and click direct IP enter in the host like the, the person who started the server their IPv4 address just there that's all you want to enter in so you just put this in press enter right I have successfully tested that method of server hosting on the LAN network and it actually works because my brother has been able to join on the local area network and I haven't had to port forward anything. It, all he's connected is using that um, IPv4 address on uh, my computer. You can see there it says D's nuts. That's his, that's his Steam name for some reason and he has successfully joined and is swimming around somewhere and he's got a ping of 13. So yes, we know that works. That is how you host a LAN server for Feed and Grow. I hope you found this video useful, and I hope that you are able to join your LAN server. Thanks for watching.